A Dallas County couple has more than one blessing to count this year, seven to be exact. <laughs> Candace and Larry Logan officially adopted seven boys this year. A handsome group right there. Now the Paulding County family needs a new van that everyone can fit in. They didn't know it, but a family member set up a GoFundMe page and they have been overwhelmed by all of the support. Fox 5's Patty Pan spent the day with the family and has their story. As if shopping for the holiday season wasn't chaotic enough, imagine shopping for seven boys. All seven of these boys are adopted. A Dallas family is making it work with a little help from the community. It's pure chaos in the Logan household, and they say it's great. Meet Candace and Larry Logan and their seven adopted boys. Isaac, Jaden, Isaiah, Elijah, Ezra, Benjamin, and Gideon. The oldest boy is 10, the youngest only three years old. It's just everybody else's life, but just time seven. The Logans have been married for 20 years and always wanted children. Their wish came true a few years ago. We had um, a family member call us because we had the largest house without children, and they knew that we wanted them, and asked us if we would take in children, and it just spiraled from there. We initially got married, we, we only wanted two children. You know, just a boy and a girl, and we would we'd be we'd have been content with that. But we got two boys, and then we went from two boys to five boys, and then the six, and then the seven. And it's like now I'm ready to have two girls and another boy. Just even at ten. All seven boys are adopted from Larry's side of the family. They are by blood cousins, but now brothers. Getting an instant family has not been easy, and the Logans are making it work on one income. But the family van is acting up. They've tried to patch it up and make it work, but recently Candace's brother-in-law saw how much trouble they were having and started a GoFundMe page without telling her. It was embarrassing at first because I thought, God, oh, it felt to me like it was. Um, modern day panhandling. But Candace is honest. The family does need a new van and adds the outpouring of support and financial help has been a blessing. Incredible. I mean, being that it's Christmas time and people that we don't even know have given to this GoFundMe, it's incredible. We just have had so many phone calls and prayers and messages and text messages and, you know, just saying how much they really want to see us get a new vehicle for Christmas. Mm -hmm. Just take a look at these smiling faces. The Logans tell me this holiday season they could not feel more blessed thanks to help from the community and, of course, God's love. If you would like to help, you can find their GoFundMe link on fox5atlanta.com. Reporting in Dallas tonight, I'm Patty Pan, Fox 5 News.